I like spending time with my family and friends. I don't think there's anything better for the soul than spending time with my family. I worked at a women's clinic when I was in graduate school and I worked there as a counselor and I realized that I was really drawn to the physician side of things. So as I progressed in my training in graduate school, I ended up deciding to go to medical school afterwards so I could be on that side and so I could be in women's health as a physician. I grew up in a family of five women and so growing up all I saw um, were issues that have impacted women and I saw my grandmother go through ovarian cancer, my mother had recurrent pregnancy loss, and with my own health issues, I don't think there's anything that I'm more passionate about than the health of a woman. I also think that um, a lot of the issues and health problems that women face are very much something that defines them. So for me, um, I really wanna be a mother, and so that defines me, and for some people, it's different, but I want to help women achieve whatever defines them. I don't think there's a specific area that I'm particularly interested in more than another, but when a patient is really passionate and has a specific goal in mind and they're invested in that, I get invested in that. And so if a woman wants definitive management for their heavy bleeding or if they want treatment for pelvic pain, and they're engaged, that really makes me excited and engaged because I love to see when patients reach a goal. My philosophy of care is to take care of my patients like I would my grandmother, my mother, or my sisters. The most rewarding moments are when we achieve something that the patient has been working towards. So that might be improvement in their bleeding, that might be definitive management with a hysterectomy, that might be improvement in their libido. Whatever the goal is of the patient, when we reach that, that's a really exciting moment.